is Tuesday, which means I am one week into my journey. That's right, this day last week, I started. And today, I feel tired. I'm wearing some awesome socks. They're flash socks. Um, and obviously the reason for that is to give me speed. I need to go away, so I'm only gonna do my stretches and then 30 minutes on the treadmill. No um, extra exercises today, and I think it's okay to do that every so often. We've got a York Megamax 3001 multi-weight gym. We also have a bench press, and we also have a um, elliptical machine. So I'm thinking of maybe setting them up and having a little home gym, because there are exercises that I can do to help strengthen and tone my muscles. Okay, so I have 30 minutes and 40 seconds on the treadmill done. 3.05 kilometers, so I'm still above the three kilometer mark. Today I went for interval level six, so it was 1.5 kilometers for two minutes, 2.5, or excuse me, 1.5 miles per hour um, for two minutes, 2.3 miles per hour for two minutes, and then three miles per hour for, for one and a half minutes, and then a half a minute at 6.5 miles per hour. And then in the last four minutes, I dropped down to 2.5 miles per hour for two minutes, and then 1.5 miles per hour for two minutes to finish me off. Um, I'm roasting. <laughs> I'm actually boiling. Um, went well. Um, I found it a little bit more difficult to run at 6.5 miles per hour than I did at the six. Obviously it's faster, but just because I wasn't doing the other exercises today, I said I'd up myself, but I think I'll go back to six miles per hour tomorrow because I know my pace wasn't good and I felt myself under pressure. Like I thought I might fall a couple of times, I had to hold on to the rail. And when that happens, the watch doesn't pick up that I'm running. So, because it's obviously hand movements. So that would explain why I'm a little bit less than yesterday, but nonetheless, I feel good. So I'm gonna go have a shower. And, oh, I'm gonna stretch out and then have a shower. Post shower, I'm still very red. I can't get rid of this redness. If anybody has tips as to how to get rid of redness, let me know. Ruby, hello! Ruby was just sitting inside, but now she's gone under the... Hello, Ruby. Hello. What I'm going to have for my dinner today is steak. I bought them in Super Value, surprise, on um, Saturday and there's two in the pack, so I'm gonna have one, but I need to go, I don't know, I might have baby potatoes. I'm going to go down to Super Value and see if they have any gnocchi, because I saw on their website that they do Super Value brand gnocchi, and I've never had gnocchi, and I'm interested in trying it. And anytime I've seen recipes to make it, it's like you're making enough for a family. I'm also going to check the frozen section for some cauliflower rice, um, because, it sounds like it's good. I'm watching my macronutrients a little bit. I'm not going full into it, but I'm just watching them a little bit to try and see how they make sense because I've never done it before. But um, the Samsung Health app allows you to track them. I am back from the downtown and <sighs> Super Value didn't have the Noki, so I'm gonna get a recipe and see if I can make some this weekend. I'm comparing my treadmill stats from today and yesterday and my average speed was six kilometers per hour yesterday and today it was 5.9 kilometers um but my maximum speed was higher today so yesterday my maximum speed was 12.8 and today it was 15.9 kilometers an hour where it gets interesting is when we look at steps per minute so yesterday my average steps per minute was 123 with a maximum of 178 whereas today it was 121 with a maximum of 194. So even though I went faster and did more steps per minute at my maximum, my averages were both lower than yesterday. And I know myself that when I was doing the three mile per hour, I was walking a bit faster yesterday than I was today. So that's definitely something um, that I noticed myself. I cooked steak for my dinner. I'm very simple. I just put some fresh cracked black pepper and some salt, a little bit of oil on the pan. So I put a tiny bit of oil on either side of the steak, massage in my salt and black pepper and then fry it um, two minutes per side. And then I had my baby corn and sugar snap peas and I cooked them in a little bit of garlic with some onion, but I don't like 
I don't like the texture of onions, so use a bit of onion powder, um, salt and pepper mm -mm, on the pan. And then I cook them first, then I wrap them in tin foil, then I cook my steak, then I let that sit. And with the juices that are on the pan, I add a little bit of corn flour and milk to make a slurry, and then I top that up with milk, and then I put that in on top with some pepper and garlic and onion and um, salt, and make my own little kind of quasi pepper sauce didn't have baby potatoes ended up having mashed uh because mom and dad were having mashed i was like oh will you put on extra for me thank you it's quarter to 11 i'm finished work with about 15 minutes and i'm going to sign off but i just wanted to give a quick reflection on my day i know i didn't show what i did but i did 30 minutes on the treadmill before i went on the treadmill i did some stretches the stretches that i did were the ones with the um elastics the resistance bands that i did yesterday i am thinking of getting different resistance bands those ones i got are rubber and they keep twisting and it's just kind of annoying so i'm thinking of getting material ones so if anybody wants to sound off let me know that's it for me today if you like this video give it a thumbs up sorry that it's not as in you know as much about what i've actually done as normal like it doesn't have my exercises but hey um, subscribe if you want to see more of my face and follow my journey and um, follow me on Instagram and Twitter the details are in the doobly doo down below and they're at the end of the video that is it for me today TTFN